The drop site for this operation will be in Canada. Strike one, this is central. You are free to engage all hostile contacts in the AO. Don't take any chances. Yes, Commander. Hey, you boy. I'm on it, Commander. Heading to that location. I got my eyes on. Commander. Marchando. I'm on the move. Come get some. Moving. That's what we're looking for. Overwatch. Aye, aye. Overwatch, aye aye. 
Heading there now. Come get some. Cosa va a explotar. Incoming fire. On the move.
fuel's about to go. Come in, Central. This is Big Sky. Emergency abort. Squad is down. Repeat, squad is down. Strike one. This is Central. You are free to engage all hostile contacts in the AO. Don't take any chances. Yes, Commander. On the move. Good to go. Estoy en marcha. Roger that. That's what we're looking for. Heading to that location. Here they come. Do this. into that location.
missed the target. Maldita sea, el enemigo sigue vivo. Getting it done. Adjusting sights. Okay. Damn it. A 
I'm on the move. He's down. Good work out there, Strike One. If I may, Commander, the lab... Commander to the research labs. Commander to the research labs. Welcome to XCOM HQ, Commander. I'm Central Officer Brad. to the research labs. Commander to the research labs. The recovered artifacts are being unloaded and the research team is waiting your orders. We'll get started as soon as you give the order, Commander. Commander, you can now honor our soldiers by awarding them medals for accomplishments you deem appropriate. You can view and award medals in the barracks. Commander to the research labs. Commander to the research labs. Commander 
to the research labs. Commander, to the research lab. <laughs> Commander to the research labs. 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 Commander. Commander to the research labs. Commander to the research labs. The complexities of our latest research projects are over. Commander, we've picked up multiple requests for assistance. Abductions in progress are marked on the Hollow Globe.
dropship has arrived. We'll be deploying to Russia for this one. Alien activity continues to surge within several major cities. Central, this is Big Sky. Strike team is touching down now. Standing by for your orders. Roger, Big Sky. Reading you 5x5. Five five. Strike 1 has the green light for deployment. Done. Solid copy. Hi, dear boy. Copy that. Come get on over. Come get some. Move. That's affirmative. Ubicación confirmada. Heading out. Overwatch. Got it. Got it. Overwatch. Solid copy. Aye, aye, Commander. Moving to position. Roger that. Estoy vigilando. ¿Qué demonio será eso? Voy. Designated position. Andando. 
Heading out. Heading there now. I'm on it, Commander. Heading to that location. I'm on. I'm on. Get to the por supuesto. Voy. Detectando la mercancía. Will do. Come get some. Stepping off. Ten four. Señor. Heading out. Man up and get back out there. Roger Dodger. Okay. 
got him. That's a load of bull. Rápido a por la presa. Enseguida. Let's rock. Moves in and reloads. And and upper rear. That's affirmative. Bit and joins her, kicking out the plate Let's glass rock. window. Solid bolt. Loading his gun. Quiet. Did you hear something? The alien keeps running, and Sanchez has a good guess hey, where he is. She peeks around the corner. No, she doesn't. Vuelva al combate. She loads her gun. 
Hamilton pulls out his rifle and puts it back. Then he runs Understood. for high cover. Moving out. He's got eyes down the lane, but can't see anything. The rookies On my sidle way. up. The enemy's up inside. The and spot another group of aliens. Realizing that they're going to need help. Help to fight this one. Finn pulls back into good cover. Out of the aye, line aye, of sight. Commander. Dambuza uh, moves up to help. Moving out. The alien friends that we just met are, are supporting one another. Sanchez debates chasing down the alien and that they were hunting earlier sees good cover. She decides to run and charges after it. Hi, dear boy. But no eyes. Oh, she gets ready. Her sniper Moving sprints out. up from behind and behind a heavy-duty truck. But he's not close enough to see anything yet. Dambuza aye, aye. Here they come. around her. Her truck and spots another group of aliens that apparently was exactly where the previous team was. They move out of the line of sight and get ready. Rolling. She drops back behind her cover. Bidden debates. It's just running, but for now, hops forward into cover. He sees one of the aliens and has an okay shot. But if he takes it. Be exposed. On my way. Backs off. Oh, you say so? Our assault can hear the hear the alien. It creeps up behind her. Se les and para then realizes this, this, this that it's scared. Ayuda. It shoots her. Yeah, and por she favor. Ayuda. Boy. She runs. <laughs> She's she's pinned and needs help. The only one close enough is Bidden. Throwing in, in some level of caution to the wind, Bidden decides that now is the okay. time. He jogs across, sees some aliens, chokes down his regrets. Throws, throws a dangerous grenade. Batter up! But our assault is safe. Dambuza that has aliens coming up her flank. I Commander. It. She pops around and flanks them and throws her own grenade. Grenade out! That cover's busted. Hamilton aye, aye, Commander. And rushes up, up and supports the first pistol. Covering now. If they charge, they might get hit. The supporting in play, uh, purple spray comes over them as they adjust their cover. They take shots oh. and shots at the exposed pit. His car Mule's catches about fire. To go. Unfortunately, one of the rookies goes down. The car explodes. But, our assault is awake again. Just in the nick of time. She jogs up and pulls the same trick pick that her friend did to save her life. Throwing her grenade right over the wall. out that alien and injuring and setting that car on fire. It's not enough to get a kill. Bidden's hurt. And that car is about to go. Position confirmed. He moves up and spots the aliens. 
And he takes out the buff one right in front of the game. He's outside of the car's explosion radius. Her sniper her jogs to the side, waiting to flank that that other alien next turn. Overwatch. Aye aye. Cars explodes. The alien in the foreground gains support from behind and moves to the side. Heavy fire it in fires this zone. on Bidden, but doesn't hit. Uh -huh. The car in front of Bidden explodes, but he's just one foot away from dying instantaneously. This is the shot he's been waiting for. But he doesn't have his rifle yet. He takes a shot with his pistol convinces the alien that today isn't the day. In the background, and our assault finally has what she's been looking for. Rápido por la presa. She dashes Recibido, into señor. hard cover. And, as, as the alien flanked, she can't hit it with her good gun, but she can and hit it with her bad one. She shoots it, cutting off the thing's support to her friend. Okay. Bitten jogs to the side. He's only got but one alien to shoot at, and with everyone hurt, has to take the shot. He hits it, but it doesn't die. Injured, the alien runs, hoping to get away from the sniper. It fires on him. I'm all right. The flanked alien charges forward to the bushes, and apparently has full cover behind him. It fires on the assault, but no dice. The sniper pulls out his rifle, and sets up at the shot he's been waiting for. Bam! Hoorah! Alien down. Finn realizes what he needs to do in order for this alien to die. And so... Double he time. sprints across, pass into the building, and out of sight. Sanchez... also backs off. Afirmativo. Realizing that no shot is better than a shot that she thinks she can survive. <laughs> Things explode. Wood splinters in the background, and she steps up. It's closer, and it's got eyes. She levels her shotgun. Bitten takes him. Copy that. Bitten steps out and sees the same thing. His shot's only okay, and so is hers. Hamilton doesn't have a shot. Heading to that because location. Unfortunately, he doesn't have squad sight yet. And, because the thing might be on Overwatch, he doesn't really want to creep up. He runs, runs behind a big, big truck, hoping that it's enough to cover him. Rifle then takes a shot, Dead and mission breaks. accomplished. While we're down one operative, we come out with ten aliens dead. Ten aliens. Is it bad for that operative? Fly back and we touch down with our spoils. Ten new aliens. Commander horses. to the situation room. And Commander to the situation room. Three new wounds. Dambuza did us well. But bit but Bitten did us better. And such he's ready. Dambuza gets gets a cross in her honor. Workshop is ready. We will be in touch, Commander. They managed to turn the lights on. Commander, the situation room. we've suffered a number of casualties and haven't found suitable replacements yet. We need to start hiring additional soldiers through the barracks. Commander to the situation room. Commander to the situation room. Oh, later. And as such, Dambuza. 
uh, will get her own medal. Gambuza's stand has its power assigned. Plus five aim against enemies in full. Commander order. to the situation room. And Commander to the situation room. Flynn where wins another reward for saving the team again. Have a vacation, Flynn. You need it. Unfortunately, this means that we've got four active soldiers. So. Send out another hire. Floor. Every member of the council is going to want satellite coverage, so we should plan our deployments carefully. And sell a whole bunch of alien horses. The new engineers arrived this morning, Commander. But We're always glad to have to more help down here. Being another satellite because of the new hires. Mexico and Argentina. Excavation arrive. complete. And our excavation is done. And so, all we can do is wait. Access lift operational. Our access lift is done. And as such, we have to start building another one. Detected. Hamilton comes back just seconds before her UFO is spotted, and we send out an interceptor. And so, it flies over. We have eyes on the bandit. With just two stinger missiles, we somehow take down the target. As it blasts one of our... Central, this is Voodoo 37. We have a confirmed kill on Bogey 001. I repeat, the UFO is down. How copy, over. Solid copy, Voodoo 37. Nice work. Central out. All right, people. Retask Recon Satellite Bravo and get me a visual on that crash site. She's coming into range now, sir. On screen. Magnify. Enhance. Still in one piece. Sure is. Commander, I recommend we get a strike team to the crash site immediately. And as such, now apparently going to send and out a team to recover her an alien ship from the ocean, I guess. Hamilton walks back out, out and says, says that he's fine, he'll go on another one, please. Oh, Hamilton. However, seeing as he's our best troop, we decide that, yeah, he's going out. Hidden successfully managed to get past the stage in his life where he has to yet yeah, wear red. And as such, he goes back, back, back out to grab up some fancy new white duds. And today, we're bringing Antily, a Sokolov, and Tom Hughes. Really? Hughes? That's hilarious. Who else do we have? Just arriving off the plane is Lucy Kelly, who is uh, good enough that we're going to keep her around. Nina Jason, who is actually pretty good too. Sarah Dunn is worth her the red uniform. And Alice Lane, our uh, you know what? Let's actually just bring Alice Lane. Alice! You're coming with us today. So, with Sokolov, Hamilton, Bitten, and Lane. Lost.
touching down. Get ready to deploy. Our AO is within the continental United States. So we're going to land. It looks like the aliens went down in a sparsely populated area. If there are civilians in the area, I hope they stay clear. Is in the middle of the mainland, I guess. We're going to locate the crashed UFO, sweep the area for crew, and shoot them. We're going to locate and secure melt canisters, except no, we're not central. We're going to avoid damage to the craft if, if possible, as some components might be recoverable. Then we're going to sell them all so we can build some satellites. And first off, the ship. Hip is our support, then our this sniper, then... We're just north of the crash our... site. Strike one is in position to engage. Loud and clear, big sky. Slightly newer we'll monitor those so readings from off. here. Strike one is authorized to assault the alien craft. And now we learn that Lane has the lowest movement speed. Well, that's fine. Doesn't bug me in the slightest because she can apparently hit things with her gun. Or at least, that's what her training records say. And so, Moving she out. forward to be joined oh, by Silverlob, then Bitten, On it. then Hamilton. Head into that location. Hamilton pulls out his sidearm in preparation Overwatch. for the aliens. I uncovered. I and so, here movement. We are actually going to go after the belt canister because typically there way. are aliens near it. Двигаюсь к точке. On my way. I'm all over it. As it stands, that's just how it goes. Without running for a bit, probably not going to actually get to the canister On the before the thing expires. And as such, we're going to bother Still jogging him. just one. I'm on the turn. move. Will do. We hear aliens somewhere behind us and have decided to ignore them. As today, our business have, has to do with this area over here. Using the hill, visual cover. We move up and realize that we're going to have to move damn fast to get to that container. Orders confirmed. Moving and out. so we move damn fast. Get to that container. Good copy, moving on target. As the aliens chase our footprints for some reason. Even though we just shot their their ship down. No, no. Moving to position. We move out and then move the extra couple tiles. Also to make sure we can reach that container next turn. Big off. And the rest of us dash up. Let's do this. And Moving to designated position. You can hear that the aliens are very Shh. firmly somewhere behind us. But we haven't had time to care. Because right now, we're going to go and touch this container and realize that it's in the corner of the map. Heading out. Dying. Next turn, we're going to swivel and and set up on this hill. I feel the yes, I the feel, feel Commander. Heading out. Steps up, up onto the hill. Owen doesn't see anything yet. Sokolov uh, moves up and gets ready. Bidden heading there now. Behind. And Sokolov apparently runs backwards. Hamilton rolls his Roll eyes. eyes and takes up the middle. Overwatch. Overwatch. Everyone readies their guns. What's making that noise? They're probably right behind that hill. Moving out. So we move up carefully. We see the next spinning tower of dismay. Двигаюсь к точке. 
Moving to position. Take cover along this short wall. Okay. And get ready. I got it. Got it. Got my eyes on. Then okay. move up. To That's what we're looking for. We've got five rounds to capture it, and we see the front of the craft on Overwatch. Just barely. In the Moving out. So, got it. Cover. Up to take the cover. I feel good. I got it. Covered. As they ready themselves for whatever is to come. What the was aliens that? are close, one of them says. On the move. Lane moves, moves in. Принято. They debate how. Affirmative. How to go, go about moving up to this container, and decide that taking this heavy cover here is the best option. Headed there now. X-ray is stays behind. But he sees the aliens first regardless. They're far, and now they've got it had eyes on his friends. Hamilton can't let that happen. So he takes his shots. Negative damage. Badly. Lane charges forward into full cover. I'm on it, Commander. Bitten's already in cover. And so Club. Uh, uh, we'll just to join Lane. Bitten already being in cover. Er, throws smoke on the two low cover members of his team. Hoping that it's enough to keep them safe. The aliens do some magic. Then more come in. Support. The supported alien jogs back. And takes a long shot out of one of the people. Oh, open fire! More aliens join the party. They're moving around the side. Hamilton and Scott got a sniper rifle and he's not afraid to take take a heavy duty shot at the mind melder. That doesn't mean he's oh, hit it. Shot wide. Bitten and is outflanked. But Position confirmed. Not for long. He moves around the side. Bitten has a good shot. <laughs> aliens. He pops it, but it's still standing. Sokolov debates his moves. And out of them, none of them are good. Lane, Lane moves On my just way. slightly further up and takes her shot and takes, yes, throws a frag grenade okay, at, at the supporting aim. Grenade out! <laughs> now that I think about it, it would have been a good move before the sniper took his shot. So Kalov swaps his cover and after debating whether or not he can hit a 65, just throws a grenade at it. Two scratches on his head. the fact that he's going to get a promotion later today. The aliens start moving. And apparently decide to move twice this turn. And take shots. Us at our half help, cover. There's a whole unit. Someone help! Absolutely. Is his shit and licks his cover. Our Russian member of the team is shooting fire over here, thinking that it's bullet. His bullets will apparently repair his wounds. Lane, however, manages to keep her brain being attached to her, her skull. Moving to position. Moments. She's got a decent angle on one of the, of the units and takes her shot. Knocks that alien out, out of the fight, and Hamilton then moves in to cover his his pan and moves in to help his panicking Heading friend. Out. He's 
got a big gun, but he can't fire it this turn. So, he just takes the low percent chance to hit it. <sighs> That's a load of blood. They're trying to pull back! The alien panics and moves back to far cover. Twice. Pitten moves back. Back to receive aid. Roger that. And Hamilton moves back to dish it out. Headed there now. Come on, you'll be back in the fight ASAP. Pitten takes oh, the yeah. time to load his gun. Sokolov manages to get his wits back about him. And returns. Yeah, got he needs to support Lane. Moving to position. X-ray spotted. And spots the most dangerous alien here. Realizing she doesn't have the tools to fight it. Got it. She hits, hits the cancel button, hidden on the detonation of the meld, and swaps her cover. No, she runs so I'm she rolling. isn't seen. Forcing the thing to move up. The alien comes at her side. They're moving around the side! And... Down one leg. Takes the shot, taking out our, the best unit we've ever had. And you're going to buffalo gum! Okay. Hamilton then leaps back in and takes a shot at, at the new alien that we've never seen before. But wow, he can't shot hit wide. it. Out of options. Bitten Moving to in. position. That rookie's gun isn't good enough to take out that alien in one hit. But a grenade might be enough. Eat this! To damage it. That rookie's got exactly one option left open to him. And either he hits this and lives, and doesn't, and dies. And he's almost certainly going to die. Ah, Mima. The sectoid crawls up our flank. And he takes he's another to shot at us. all you got. It's not enough. The outsider panics and runs. I need to shoot in the has oh! a no! 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 I want to go home! On Our it. support is completely <laughs> incapable of not panicking. <laughs> and Hamilton. And Ben is just done with this. He takes a shot at the sectoid. But today the wind just isn't right. Missed the target. The sectoid takes another shot out of Hamilton. I'm under Sorry, fire! That's fitting, but can't hit it. The dangerous alien comes back and takes a shot. I'm sitting down he here! Hit. Suppressed by two different aliens and out of real options. It's Heading to forward. that location. Can't hit this alien. Both his friend, both he and his friend, might die. So dead and gone. Unlike that Russian, he hits it. However, there was still the problem. Heading out. Some of this other alien. Hamilton dodges back. Heck, can take shots, but one damage isn't enough to drop an alien. <laughs> Sectoid takes shots long, and Bitten goes down. Hamilton is now the only one left. He takes out his rifle and gets ready. He's the long haul. He starts taking shots. I'm about to start keeping score. Chalk up another one. And realizes that he's carrying this whole damn UFO back by himself. expecting this. They were some of our best. Hidden, appar I wish there was more Hamilton apparently done. doesn't get a goddamn promotion somehow. 
And so he steps back off the Sky Ranger, shaking his head. If only his friends could stop getting hit. Then we sell as much. Then we sell just enough things, things to get this satellite producing. Because boy, are we going to need it. These alloys aren't the most fun thing to sell, but we don't have much of a choice. This satellite has to start getting built. Because Argentina absolutely will need the support. But it'll be one day late. And so, the globe starts spinning. Access lift operational. having a hard time grasping what it is the aliens are hoping to accomplish here. Are they studying us? Why abduct humans seemingly at random? There must be a pattern that we haven't established yet. We have two months to get that research done. And so... We need to build this alien jail. We don't have the power, or the funds, which is why we're digging. In seven days, we get told that our... Commander, we're tracking several reported abductions via the Hologlobe. I've got the coordinates locked in. We get to choose who we're losing. And really, we need money. So, we're going to Africa. Hamilton is now one of the few people left on our team. But... He wipes his nose, and is done with it. He's ready. Unfortunately, the only person left, left to his Hamilton from the first squad, is the crazy man with the rocket launcher. So, we're going to bring him. Oh yeah, and Sanchez. I forgot she was still alive. Other than that, we've only got red shirts left. And we're back down to eight soldiers. We go back to the gray market. Sell enough things to buy more soldiers. Go back to the barracks. As the alien attacks have become more frequent, our casualty rate has climbed. Our troop shortage is becoming a problem. We should start screening potential candidates at the barracks immediately. As we sell enough to hire four more soldiers to fill the empty chairs. And then we go to deploy in Nigeria. We have visual on the mission site. Listen up. We're going to be dropping you deep in the Nigerian interior for the next operation. And so, we're going to operate. Local government Benjamin forces Hammer. have reported...
requesting authorization to deploy. Solid copy, Big Sky. Strike one is cleared to engage. And it seems this game has managed to learn who I am, as the first thing they give us is a door to breach. And a roof to climb onto. These are both good things. But first... Heading there now. We must get ready to do that. I'm on it, Commander. Roger, tracking. And yes, sir! This is slow. I feel Commander. Auto watch. Roger. I've got my eyes on <laughs> Hamilton then opens the door to reveal nothing. Cunningham rolling out jogs in. As the team readies for their next solid operation. copy, Commander. Orders confirmed. On the move. All in ass. And then they breach the next room. Visual on the goods. Three aliens. Then, again, we engage Operation War Games. One of our rookies, aye, aye, Phoenix has a promising Enemy flank spotted. right off the bat. But unfortunately, that flank is crawling with even more aliens. And everyone rolls their eyes. Luckily, we had our rocket launcher set up before this combat even started, and so... Oh, the man with the rocket launcher... Her... Her... Her aims to blow out... Out a whole lot of aliens all at the same time. Two aliens die. One is exposed. So our sniper lines up the shot. Unfortunately, adjusting sights. Hamilton can't hit everything. So Cunningham takes hers. But it's not a fatal hit. Running out of options. Moving out. Hughes decides to jog in and take that that fatal last shot on Dead and, gone. and it dies before it can find more cover. They're trying to pull back. The second step back. out and run. Breaking more doors in the process. Rushes up. Even though he's got shot an LMG, line. he can't hit anything. Welcome to America. The aliens sidle up and land a decent hit. And got something over here. up our flank. Hamilton takes a shot, but alas, a pistol isn't enough to kill aliens. They dodge for cover. Hughes 
these jogs up for half cut. Uh, these On the jogs move. up for half cover. And is flanking the alien. He takes a shot. It's not good enough. Adjusting sights. Cunningham drops to adjacent. I'm on the move. And says good. He's down. But there's still an alien over there. Getting it done. Jordan readies himself for next round. Back in. Loading his gun. Hamilton. And runs up, up to the roof. Stepping off. As the music remembers that there are, in fact, aliens here. <laughs> the aliens can't get to Hamilton this round, but they're going to try. What the hell was that? They're inevitably moving up. And they're supporting as well. Lines of support crisscross. The aliens start to move around. Copy Hamilton that. dodges, is in behind, and the aliens and spots too. thinks about, about what she can do, and realizes that her grenade is just out of range. Instead, she fires, but she doesn't hit. Target still up. Jordan pops his door, and although he sees those aliens, he has better ideas. has a shot, but it's not a good one. But Hughes already knows he doesn't need it. Incoming! Solid copy. Hamilton knows this fight isn't over gets ready for next round. As the lines of support go forward, the aliens move again, Hamilton sets up his rifle. Got it moves covered. for the corner of the building. Jordan knows it's stupid to move forward. And he Roger that, I'm scanning. Hughes needs ammo. On the move. Ready to rock. Aye, aye, Commander. Cunningham. Good to go. And thanks, Commander. She's wounded. There's movement. And support. The aliens move. And have shots again. They're trying to pull back. They hit the machine gunner. But that's the shot Hamilton's been waiting for. X-ray down. Scared and alone. On the watch. More sectoid out there still. Solid copy. Hughes move up. Rolling out. I'm on it. There now. Hamilton and decides to make an executive decision to move down and first aid his friend. Good as new. Jordan and Ru Got runs it. up and across the roof. Hughes pops the door. 
doesn't see anything yet. Heading there now. He watches across the road. Roger that. Ready Scanning. Alice On my way. Got it covered. They listen and hear. You hear that? Hamilton moves back to the roof and reloads his rifle. We're green to go. Copy that. Jordan moves across. On the watch. And readies to spray. Moving to position. Alice moves up. She's found the alien. And she decides to let him take Commander. just one shot. Bye bye. Earning his stripes. But Cunningham knows it's not over. She pops the door near her. Roger that scanning yet. But more aliens spring into the fray. She was ready. Into it. Not enough. <laughs> Hamilton would have a nice shot on my so way. Far. Drops down and runs up. But he's still too far. Round to that. Freddy's scanning for next round. Yes, sir. Jordan runs up to cover from, from the front of the truck. The aliens didn't have enough time. Time to get anywhere, really. Cunningham. Ham runs up the side of the building. Got it. Moving. Getting ready to fight on another front. Position confirmed. Hughes tries to acquire the other one. And he gets it. He smashes the window down and tries to take the shot. Hughes, however, can't hit the broad side of the bar. The cowering alien then supports his friend. Standing, still flanked, takes a shot. Hamilton and weaves up behind Good to go. Behind the supporting alien. And, has, and lines up the shot with his pistol. But Ooh, can't that hit him. is not good. Hughes is too far. And Cunningham. And I'm on the move. Do it. But she thinks that she can land the world's silliest grenade toss. Luckily, she's he spent all day be throwing tennis balls at her dog and landing it squarely three yards. Earning her stripes. Another day, another successful operation. And, fi and Hamilton comments that finally they managed to make it back to the Sky Ranger without him having to carry everyone. Can I have a goddamn. Can someone please take the cap off this optic for me now? And as such, he still has to fire from close range. Tom Hughes and Alice Cunningham both decide that what. But Hamilton do and is doing his cool and ask for rifles of their own, frustrating the commander greatly as now his whole team is made of snipers. Damn it. And we've gained the International Service Cross. And we've gained another pair of the other two medals. We earn 200 Remember, money we and will be piss watching. off the rest of the planet. But we've still got out a couple countries. We go to the gray market. Debate selling more aliens. And realize that we're going to need all this money for a few days later. And everyone yells at me that they're dying. 
we've got nothing left to build. The Arc Thrower is going to take the rest of time. But, over to the metal screen. We've got one more metal to name. So we go to the memorial. And... Name the International Service Cross, the Bidden Cross. Debating in how to use this power, we grab at the aim penalty. Sorry, the aim bonus, and debate who to give this to before giving it back to Hamilton. He salutes us because we keep giving him honors. As we a debate who to give the other her, her ones to. And in the end... The ones that make the most sense, hence for this medal, have always been the snipers. And so, Tom Hughes earns a medal. And apparently, we only give uh, medals to black members of our community. I'm kind of okay with that. And we decide that we really, really don't want a certain member of our party panicking. Out of everyone here, it's probably Sanchez. Now would you please get out from behind that crate? So, the globe starts spinning. Complete. More soldiers show up on site. Let's go examine them. And one of our new soldiers is Sarah Walker from um, the good old land down under, who can aim marginally okay, and also has is scared of her own shadow. Then we have even Ivan Novikov, who's just better than her in every way. That is... actually impressive. Lucas Vogel also shows up, who is a fairly decent troop. Mostly because... his willpower is good enough to do the thing sometimes. And Burnett Madow, who is overall kind of garbage, but not actually unacceptable. Just barely. But they'll replace the losses we've had so far. This council report tells Incoming us what a bad boy we've been. Hello, Commander. As much to our regret, ouch. a number of Literally council members have recently withdrawn their support. Meaning that we. He this does not bode well for XCOM, Commander. These recent departures from the Council are of serious concern. Yeah, yeah you're not You've wrong. You've done an admirable job in combating the alien threat over the course of this past month, Commander. However, we still believe there is room for improvement in your efforts. Welcome to Iron Man Impossible. When you're lose, when you're winning, you're still losing. We will be in touch, Commander. Carry on. However, losing in three countries is basically standard. And really, we were making some choices in order to be more careful about it. Our satellite is prepped and standing by for launch. We are ready to deploy it on your orders. From what little I've seen of their technology, if the aliens were intent on conquering Earth. There's not much we could do to stop them. I'm guessing they have something else in mind. We don't have enough engineers on staff. And as such, we still can't build another satellite uplink. But what we can do is start building the satellites for it. Commander, 
Our current satellite uplink facilities are at full capacity. So we should build additional uplinks as soon as possible to allow for new satellite deployment. As we wait for additional Commander, we have multiple reports of new abductions in progress. The locations are marked on the hologlobe. Russia offers us $200. Japan offers us four scientists. And South Africa offers us four engineers. Frankly, Japan was probably going to leave anyway. And Russia, like we don't need the money. So we're going thing to South Africa, because I can. And I've just realized that that's not a good idea. So we're going to go to Russia. And so, we're going to start bringing only one un, un rookie from now on. The missions are going to start getting more dangerous. And as such, we deck out Hughes, who's in our standard black sniper's gear. And give Sanchez and tell Sanchez that for recovering from a wound and coming back, Earned this fedora. Done. Let's hope you live as we. Strike one. Prepare for landing. We'll be deploying to Russia for this one. Current updates from the ground. And we land. As the camera shakes violently, our metal bird sets down really damn close to the end objective. As our snipers, po snipers and assault pour out. So our red Central, shirt. Big Sky in position on approach of the abduction site. Strike one is awaiting drop clearance. Copy that, Big Sky. And Strike one is cleared right to away. engage hostile targets. Watch your backs out there, people. It's a beautiful, beautiful roof. Yes, we're sir. Just going to That's get That's what right we're now. looking for. Weapons hot. We see some alien terrorists. And apparently, there are sectoids on the fucking roof. They're on the move! Well, that's actually pretty unlikely. Shit. Let's do this. Roger, Dodger. And Sanchez is the only Paso one ligero. that can even possibly think about doing anything after getting on the roof. We now have three turns to do this, or else Hamilton is dead forever. And of course, he has a med kit. Hey, didn't you already shoot, bastard? Shit! It crashed. Well, okay, let me fucking launch it again. That's not what we meant. Sorry about that, guys. Alright, let me just set this back up. There we go. That was weird. Okay then. A 
apparently we get to try that again. Hmm. It's a little uncomfortable, actually. Okay, then. I guess we'll, uh... Yes, Commander. Approach the roof a little more cautiously this time. On the move. I'm on the move. Something tells me we shouldn't just go straight for the roof, huh? Well, okay, there's some doors we can breach over here. Let's just creep up to the building. Heading to that location. Visual on the goods. Whoa! Okay. So, we've got some creepy crawlies, and we've got quite a lot of thin men. Here they come. And now we're wishing we had a rocket launcher on us. Unfortunately, we don't have a rocket launcher on us. I'm on it, Commander. Running. Si, sí, señor. Out of our options, I actually think think that pulling to back that is probably better. I don't really got. like getting shot at by thin men, but on the other hand, Overwatch, I'm fine with that. Crawlies are going to be coming at us soon. <laughs> Hamilton then lines up his shot and goes for it. But you can't hit that. Miss the target. Use. And. Sanchez throws her grenade and attempts attempt to take her cover. All that thin man's cover is gone. The only one left is Hughes. Hughes takes his shot, though. No longer a threat. And luckily, Hughes is a bit of a marksman. Moving. Dunn moves up the side and spots one of the aliens. She takes her shot and damages him. One of the thin men drops down from the roof and takes a close-up shot of the oh God, God, get me out of here! She dies. Hughes panics and takes a gunshot, but it's not enough. the other thin men and creeps up our flank. Takes a shot at our sniper. Got a lot of heat on me! They're moving around the side! Hughes gets strangled. Trying to pull back! 
Taking fire over here. That's just lucky, really. over. Well, I said I've succeeded on this, this difficulty before, and it wasn't lying. It's still a son of a Better bitch up. sometimes. there was something we could do. Anything at all. Remember, we will be watching. With three countries poised to leave the XCOM project, and four just behind them, with four already on our doom tracker, there's nothing we can do. Commander, we're in desperate need of additional troops. If we don't start recruiting new soldiers through the barracks soon, we're not going to win this fight. Central, we're not going to win the fight anyway. As it stands, while we could limp forwards and try to win regardless, there just isn't enough. <laughs> 